before we dive into file organization, I have to, I keep forgetting to talk to you about the poles for the 100 mile race I'm doing in uh, a month, three weeks. Basically, I can't use them. It's against the rules. That's right. I'm glad I read the rule book. Holy smokes. Actually, somebody on Facebook commented and said, you might want to just double check to see if you're allowed to use trekking poles in Run Rabbit Run 100. You are not allowed. I don't know why. It's interesting. Bottom line, uh, I'm glad I found out a week ago and not the day before the race or at the starting line. Holy smoke. So yeah, it makes my whole task of running 100 miles a little more difficult, but uh, you keep smiling and, um, and you keep fighting. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. I don't know. But I'd, I still love the poles. I still love these poles and I'm going to use them a ton over the next 30 years, 40 years, you know. Test one, two, three, test one, two, three, test one, two, three, test, test, test. Doing something a little different, recording on the patio, not in the shed. The only reason I can record right here is because our neighbors got a new air conditioning unit and it's quiet, it's quiet. The vlog is about to turn very technical. If you're not into technical, it's okay. You can click away, I understand. But what I'm about to talk about is file organization for a daily vlog specifically, but even just a vlog in general. How do I organize my video files? It's very important. It's critical for the daily vlog success. Point number one, point number one for daily vlog file organization. The basic premise is that you never, ever delete raw files. Never delete raw files, meaning you, you hit record on a camera, you stop, that is a raw file that is not edited. You always want the raw files for five years down the road, 10 years down the road, 15 years down the road, 50 years down the road, okay? Never delete raw files. Also, never delete projects. Whether, whether you're using Adobe, iMovie, Final Cut Pro, you never want to delete a project which is what a daily vlog is comprised of, a project. So my workflow is this. I film onto a memory card. I take the memory card out of the camera. I put the memory card into my computer on the side, and then I import those raw files into Final Cut Pro. That's what I use for now, for now. And then once I import into Final Cut Pro, I can edit those files into the magic of the daily vlog. Capiche? So I store the raw files on my computer's internal hard drive, on the computer first, as I'm, as I'm editing. And then after about three weeks, my one terabyte internal hard drive on my MacBook Pro fills up and then I have to make space and I have to move those files somewhere. So where do I move them to? An external hard drive. This external hard drive, I believe is two terabytes. This is SJD1. Meaning, this is the first external hard drive I fill, filled up in 2016 after I started the daily vlog. So, I've never, ever deleted a raw file. Here's one, here's two, and guess what we're on now? We are on external hard drive six. Six people, and I, it's a four terabyte, it's inside, it's crazy. So this is how I label my projects and my files, specifically the vlogs, once I import them into the computer. All right, you ready for this? Right now, because we're on external hard drive six, I label it SJD6 underscore vlog 877 underscore the title or the theme of the vlog underscore the specific date. So August 23rd, 2018. Does that make sense? So if you noticed at the beginning and the end of every vlog, I label, I label the vlog with a specific number and the date, and that way I can I can know when I go back and watch a vlog in, I don't know, five years, ten years down the road, I'll know, okay, that number, 813, vlog 813, is going to be stored on SJD6, I guess, no, it would be SJD5. Does that make sense? But what I need to do next is I need to label on the side of the external hard drives the dates the specific dates that are stored on here. So once my MacBook Pro fills up, I drop 
the library from Final Cut Pro, I drop the library onto this external hard drive. It takes, you know, maybe two or three hours to move like 500 gigabytes of data onto this guy. And I need to do a better job personally of labeling on the side of the external hard drives. Okay, from May 2017 to July 2017, is on this external hard drive. Let's say it's just, let's say it's SJD4 at that point. So I, I'm, I'm working on my system as well. That is my labeling system. That way I know where everything is at on the given hard drive. What I also want to do, and this is a long-term goal when I have a little more money, a little more money, is I want a master external hard drive. Let's say it's 50 terabytes, maybe 100 terabytes. We're talking a big one and I want to copy all of the files from these guys, and I've got six of them now, onto the master. And then, like I've already told you guys before, my Uncle John in Colorado Springs, he takes all of his external hard drives and he stores them at a bank in a, in a, in a fire-protected vault. Isn't that amazing? So, in case, in case something tragic were to happen to your house, you don't lose all of your files. So all of his home videos, all of his photos are safe forever on an external hard drive at a bank. It's just, it's brilliant, it's brilliant. So that's a long-term goal, just put that away. I hope that helps. Question of the day, how do you organize your raw video files if you're a YouTuber especially? Maybe you're a photo editor. What's your system? How do you go about it? What's your methodology? Share down below in the comments. I would appreciate it. Okay. That's all she wrote. Speaking of uh, files, time to pull the memory card out. Wish I could film that for you, but that wouldn't make any sense because the memory card's in the camera right now recording me. Love you guys. I hope the tips helped. And listen, you got to find what works best for you. What I just showed you works for me, but figure out what works for you. You know, tweak it a little bit. Love you guys. Seek beauty. Work hard. Love each other. Let's go up.